The natural world contains about 8 million species. Although many scientists say the true figure could be millions more. Despite this staggering number, some of them ended up slightly stranger than the rest of the animal. Here are 10 of the strangest animals that inhabit our planet. Number 11. Suriname Toad. The common Suriname toad is similar in appearance to a mottled brown leaf and is almost completely flat. Its feet are broadly webbed with the front toes having small, star-like appendages. Males can grow up to 154 mm, whereas females can reach up to 171 mm. Females can be distinguished not only by their length, but also by their ring-shaped cloacas, visible when they are ready to breed. Their skin color is mostly light brown with some darker spots on the back, so they can easily avoid predators. The head of the Pippa Pippa has a very flat appearance and is triangular. It also has very small black eyes that are located on the top of their head. These are not the only different characteristics, the toads have very long fingers that end in four star-shaped lobes. The Suriname toad has no teeth and no tongue. Number 10. Japanese Spider Crab. The Japanese spider crab, Macrochericum fairy, is a species of marine crab that lives in the waters around Japan. It has the largest leg span of any arthropod. It goes through three main larval stages along with a prezoal stage to grow to its great size. Its diverse taxonomic history is an important part of what these creatures are and how they evolved to be what they are today. They are sought by crab fisheries and are considered a delicacy in Japan. Conservation efforts aim to protect these creatures and their population from overfishing. Number 9. Leaf-tailed gecko. Leaf-tailed geckos have long, flat bodies with triangular heads and broad, leaf-like tails. The giant leaf-tailed gecko, or common flat-tailed gecko, is one of the larger species. They have big, marbled eyes with red concentric striations around a pupil set against a background of silver, tan or gold. These lizards have a mottled pattern, with colors varying across species from tans and greens to grays and browns. They also possess the ability to camouflage with the colors of their environment, as well as the shapes and vegetation of the forests they inhabit. Fringed flaps on their lower jaws and the sides of their bodies flatten against a surface, obscuring their outline. The increased surface area reflects and refracts light, breaking the line between the perimeter of their body and the surface beneath them. With these adaptations, leaf-tailed geckos can almost completely camouflage against dry leaves or the bark of trees. Number 8. Ankle Wachesis. The Ankle Watusi is a large African breed of cattle first domesticated in parts of Africa thousands of years ago. Bred to survive in times where food and water are scarce, these cattle can adapt to living in extreme environments, both hot and cold. Famous for their long thick horns, Watusi have the largest horn circumference found in any cattle breed. The horns were adapted to allow dispersal of excess body heat in the hot climate they lived in. Watusi fur color can be a variety of colors, but the most dominant color is a reddish brown. Cattle have been valued in Africa as ceremonial animals and as symbols of wealth and power. The shape and size of the animal's horns determined the beauty of the herd and was significant for the owner's poison in society. Watusi were first brought into the United States in the 1960s from European zoos and are now seen in both the commercial beef industry on cattle ranches as well as zoos throughout the world. Number 7. Blue Dragon. Blockus atlanticus also known as the blue dragon, is a species of brightly colored sea slug and can be found in temperate and tropical waters. Like most nudibranches, this species incorporates toxic chemicals or stinging cells from its prey into its own skin. This ability provides the blue glaucus with a defense mechanism against predation. Despite its impressive arsenal of defense tactics, the blue glaucus rarely reaches more than 3 cm long. And, unlike most benthic nudibranches, this species lives throughout the entire water column. An air bubble stored in its stomach keeps the nudibranch afloat. The creature often floats on its backside, showing its brightly colored underbelly to airborne predators. The bright blue color acts as camouflage against a backdrop of ocean waves, while the animal's grayish backside blends with the bright sea surface, concealing it from predators below. Number 6. Scorpionfly. Macopterans also known as scorpionflies after their largest family, Panorpidae, in which the males have enlarged genitals raised over the body that look similar to the stingers of scorpions and long beak-like rostra. The Batacidae, or hangingflies, are another prominent family and are known for their elaborate mating rituals, in which females choose mates based on the quality of gift prey offered to them by the males. A smaller group is the snow scorpionflies, family Boridae, adults of which are sometimes seen walking on snowfields. In contrast, the majority of species in the order inhabit moist environments in tropical locations. Number 5. long neck Turtle the eastern long-necked turtle is an East Australian species of snake-necked turtle that inhabits a wide variety of water bodies and is an opportunistic feeder. The carapace is generally black in color, some may be brown. It is broad and flattened with a deep medial groove. The scutes are edged in black and those individuals with a lighter background color. The neck is long and narrow, typical of the subgenus Chelidina, and reaches a length of approximately 60% of the carapace length. 
The neck has numerous small pointed tubercles and is gray to black in color. Females tend to grow to larger sizes and have deeper bodies. When it feels threatened, this turtle will emit an offensive smelling fluid from its musk glands. This trait gives the turtle one of its other common names, stinker. The eastern long-necked turtle is carnivorous, eating a variety of animals. Number 4. Dugong. The dugong is a marine mammal. It is one of four living species of the order Serenia, which also includes three species of Manatees. It is the only living representative of the once diverse family Dugongidae. The dugong is the only Serenian in its range, which spans the waters of some 40 countries and territories throughout the Indo-West Pacific. The dugong is largely dependent on seagrass communities for subsistence and is thus restricted to the coastal habitats which support seagrass meadows, with the largest dugong concentrations typically occurring in wide shallow protected areas such as bays and mangrove channels. The northern waters of Australia between Shark Bay and Morton Bay are believed to be the dugong's contemporary stronghold. Number 3. Babarusa. The babarusa is a wild, naked-looking pig that is native to the Indonesian archipelago. Male babarusas are known for their bizarre tusks, which, if they are not worn down or broken in combat, will eventually grow long enough to pierce the animal's skull. Babarusa is Malay for hog deer, a name that arose from the resemblance their tusks bear to antlers. Although the male's massive tusks are intimidating, they are brittle and break easily. They are not used as weapons, but instead to shield the boar's eyes during fights. Dagger-like lower tusks are used to ward off rivals. If lower tusks become dull, the boar sharpens them by rubbing them against trees. When males fight over mates or territory, they stand side by side and push each other with their shoulders. Number 2. Softshell Turtle. The spiny softshell turtle is one of the largest freshwater turtle species in North America. They can be distinguished from other turtle species by their carapace. Unlike most other turtles, their shell is soft, flat, and rubbery. The edges of the carapace are pliable with small spines, males have more than females. An adult female's carapace can be anywhere from 7 to 19 inches in length, while the male's is much smaller at 5 to 10 inches in length. The turtle's nose is long and pig-like, and its feet are fully webbed. This helps the spiny softshell turtle swim, since it spends most of its life in the water. Number 1. Jerboa. The jerboa is a small, hopping rodent that lives in the deserts of northern Africa and Asia. Jerboas are incredibly cute animals and have very long ears, tails, and hind feet that give them an almost cartoonish appearance. They also have specially adapted legs that allow them to move about by jumping like a kangaroo. Jerboas are animals that have earned a reputation for being extremely cute as well as resilient. These tiny desert rodents have a distinctive appearance and thrive in the harsh, dry desert environments of northern Africa and Asia. There are approximately 33 species of jerboas. They all share the same general features of a tiny, mouse-like head. As its name suggests, the long-eared jerboa has even longer ears than other species of this rodent.